The Valley is now home to the only accredited breast cancer center. This increases or raises the bar uh, for breast care. And it's not only breast cancer care, but even benign breast disease or not cancer uh, of the breast, any issues that women have. Doctors Rick Martinez and Carlos Garcia Cantu say the prestigious honor allows them, along with the rest of the staff at the breast center at Doctors Hospital at Renaissance, to offer patients diagnosed with the disease world-class patient-centered medical care. With the uh, protocolized treatment, with the multidisciplinary, multidisciplinary treatments that are going to be very specific for the patients when they, uh, unfortunately, are uh, victims of breast cancer. Not all centers receive the honor by the National Accreditation Program for Breast Centers. Those that apply must prove the commitment to providing the highest quality of care by undergoing an evaluation process every year. None of us could have done this as an individual. It was a definitely a, a, a team effort from administration, from staff at the cancer center, from the surgeons. Everybody came together to, to get this accreditation. Last year in Texas alone, according to the American Cancer Society, over 16,000 women were diagnosed with breast cancer. Over 2,500 of those diagnosed died. Breast cancer is the most commonly diagnosed cancer among Hispanic women. And with a large majority of Hispanics populating Hidalgo County, cancer care is of the utmost importance. The important thing here is to know okay, is how different is the breast cancer that we see here in the valley or the, in the Hispanic population compared with uh, the regular uh, population throughout the United States. Uh, and uh, that's something that is possible now. Currently, the center is able to treat over 250 analytic breast cancer cases in a year. But with the growing number of cases, space becomes a necessity. That's why the Breast Cancer of Excellence is already in the works to help in the early diagnosis of cancer in women in the valley. That will help the patient convenience. They'll be able to go to one place and see everybody in, in one facility. Mm -hmm. In Edinburgh, Patrick Shelvier, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.